Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be reviewing these beautiful silicone molds from BB Craft. And I am going to next be going over what products I use to make them. And also I am going to go over um, their YouTube program. So stay tuned, I will be right back and I'm going to go over what materials I used. Hey guys, so let's start off with the resin that I use. This is Liquid Diamonds. Now this resin is a 2 to 1 ratio um, resin. So two parts resin and one part hardener. And I highly recommend this. This is much uh, more expensive, but there is absolutely no odor whatsoever. And it um, mixes very, very well and very, very quickly. Beautiful resin, it comes out crystal clear. So I definitely recommend it. If you have the extra coin, definitely invest in it if you do resin art, okay? I got these off of Amazon. This is what I used in my beautiful mold um, to make the resin art. So these are just some um, mini little shells. And then most of the stuff here, all these pigments and the glitters, they're all from Primal Flow, another company I highly recommend. Um, they have great pigments. So I used, <coughs> sorry, um, Color Maui, Aqua Pearl, Mica, Indigo, um, let's see, White Gold Mica, and White Mica Flake. And then I use some mermaid glitter, and then this beautiful gold glitter. And then I also used, it's called Fair Winds. It's from Dryer Days. This is actually my favorite glitter ever to this date uh, for resin art. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's a very fine uh, glitter. And then last but not least, I got these little uh, blue glass chips from Laura's Art Corner. Okay, so that is what I use. And also, if anyone wants me to make a more detailed um, resin art tutorial, please leave uh, in the comments below because I did make one many uh, months ago. Uh, it's like a 45 minute video, but um, I wanted to kind of do uh, a shorter one, um, but a more detailed resin art tutorial. So let me know if you want me to make one in the comments below. So I will be right back and we are going to unmold these uh, beautiful sea creature molds. I will be right back. Hey guys, so I am so excited to unmold these. I just want to say that I took out some of them already just to check them. And I have to say that these are some of my favorite molds I have ever, ever gotten and used. These are so adorable. And I hope they have more of these, like types of like, let's say different creatures on their website. But first of all, they came out so adorable. So I'm gonna quickly unmold these little octopuses. Octopus, not octopi. So he's a little fishy. And they really pop out very fast. I mean, they're really great quality molds. They are adorable. So they just came out beautiful. I am very, very, very happy with them. They are really, really good quality. And you know, they clean pretty fast. They're so soft. See if you can see that. And that's that Fair Winds glitter in there. See how it sparkles? Okay, so these are really awesome. I'm really happy with them. Um, really some of the best molds I have ever used. These are so cute. Little seahorse, and I'm planning to use them, like these little pieces here, probably in my paper craft. So that's what I kind of love with these small ones. You can make earrings with these, you can make pendants, all kinds of jewelry. And like I could definitely attach them to other paintings um, that I have made. 
and I will show you that in a minute what I can do with them but I really feel like I want to use some of these in my paper crafts so let me just do this so you can kind of see it I mean and the textures and the designs are very well formed so I am really really happy with these and they really pop out very very easily I can't wait to do this one, but I'm going to do the smaller ones first. Yeah, see, like, the detail is amazing in these. See that? Very cool. Yeah, these really pop out. Just pop, pop, pop. So, we'll do these three. These are so nice. Okay. Yeah, I definitely see, I have this beautiful mermaid inspired paper that actually I really want to um, just attach these little guys to. Uh, I'm really excited about them. They are so pretty. And you can use them for all different things. Like I said, you can like just give them as gifts. You can make jewelry. I like to try molds out first before I make jewelry with them to see how they are. And these are the last ones, except for the big one. See, look at the de detail in that. It's really, really awesome. Sorry, the focus. There we go. Okay. And the last guy. Let's put these down. And you get a lot of them. This is a lot. And I think this was like $10, $15. So that was really awesome. So this is the big guy. And I actually added all the different colors to this. So let's pop this guy out. This is this you these are usually harder. Well, nope, not at all. That's how awesome these are. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is. You could use these as a paperweight. You can make a lot of them and like do a whole little scene. Um, so these are gorgeous. I am very happy with them and I put shells, those little shell pieces in there. And that's the back. Yeah, so um, what I can do, this is an old piece I made. I can actually, this is all resin art as well. I can actually attach them to here. See, something like that. So I could definitely use them doing that. My paper crafts, I can make jewelry. So these are, I highly recommend these. These are beautiful. They pop out super, super easy. Um, I usually let my resin cure like 24 hours and look how many you get. Just tons of them. So yeah, um, very, very quickly, I just want to like reiterate the YouTube program if you're interested. And basically, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm going to put the link below to these beautiful molds. I'm going to put a link below to their website. And I'm going to put a link below to the BB Craft uh, YouTube program. And really quickly, all you need is 100 subscribers or more, and they will review your channel. And yeah, you can, you, you know, uh, make videos and receive products that you can use for your channel, for yourself to make beautiful things with. I think it's a beautiful program. And I think I really love the fact, like I said, that they do work with smaller channels and I and I just really appreciate that and I love that and their products um, as you saw in my last video with the paper punch and these are just absolutely gorgeous I mean this is heavy this is a substantial uh, you know mold uh, they are very high quality they're super soft and I'm sure they will be very easy to clean it comes right off and I really highly recommend them and I highly recommend BB Craft as well. So that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you love these beautiful molds and what I made with them. I am really happy with them. I think they're absolutely adorable, high quality, and I'm going to be absolutely making more of them. I'm probably going to make some jewelry. And then um, maybe in another video, I'll show you what I did. I definitely want to incorporate these smaller pieces in my paper crafts. That's what I really am looking at them right now for. Um, but yeah, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button if you really found value in this video. If you enjoy the content, please subscribe. And uh, you could 
follow me on my social media the links will be below as well thanks for watching guys and i will see you in the next one bye